Ciao baby, Tanya Paul here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and press that bell icon to never ever miss an upload. Hey, how are you? I hope you're having a wonderful day and you're super duper excited for today's try on haul. Well, today I will be sharing with you some realistic office outfit ideas. Keep in mind that every workplace is different and these outfit ideas are only here to inspire, not meant to be forcefully worn at your workplace. So how's it gonna work? Basically, I will share with you some outfits, I will try them on, I will tell you a few things about these outfits and your job here is actually to be the judge. You are going to pick your favorite outfit and then at the end of the try and haul, at the end of the video, you're gonna let me know in the comment section the favorite outfit, of course, and why you picked that outfit. I hope it sounds fun. I'm super excited to see and read your comments and see and know whether you're gonna wear this outfit to your workplace. Maybe you're just gonna get inspired and create something else and wear this outfit on your daily basis. Or, and wear these outfits. I just wear these outfits out there on a daily basis. Who cares? Anyway, uh, let's go on and let's try these outfits. Well, how do we feel about this outfit? And have you seen what I did with the sweater? I'm not sure whether anyone have done this trick before. I'm sure someone did. But it's actually a great idea if you have a long sweater and you want to crop it, but you want to crop it. Just put a belt around your waist, around the sweater, and then just lower your sweater. It's a great trick. I did a trick like that before, like maybe like a year ago, but I use actually a crop top, basically like a sports bra. You put it on and then you tuck it in your sweater inside. It's a little bit different vibe, but it looks super cute. I also wasn't really sure about these pants. Check them out. They're actually velvet. I'm not really sure you can tell because when I tried it on uh, with the blouse, it didn't really look that great. But pair it with the sweater and the blouse together with the purse and with the slim back pumps, I feel like it's working and it looks cute. I love it. Let me know in the comment section whether you like it too. And let's change. Well, what can I say? I really love these tights. They're Magli for Wolford. And I actually did a review on my second channel called Tiny Pull Reviews. Check it out!
Well, is it which season or are we going back to work? It's hard to say. I absolutely love this outfit. It's a little bit gothic, but I love it. It's maybe a bit extra, but I'm here for it. I love being extra. Not sure you noticed. <laughs> anyway, let me know in the comment section how you like it. This skirt, I'm gonna come closer. I'm gonna show it to you a little bit better. The skirt is from uh, House of CB, if I'm not wrong. And you can zip it up, you can zip it down. It's a little bit problematic. <laughs> it's a little bit difficult to actually zip it up. Uh, that's why they say that you need someone else to help you, but I did it myself. The tights, you know the deal. I really love it. I love this outfit. Let me know in the comment section how you love this outfit. Well, what can I say? I absolutely love, love, love this outfit. It's way too cute. I wasn't really sure where to put the sweater. I was thinking whether I should leave it outside or whether I should tuck it in. I decided to go for a slicker look and I decided to tuck it in and I'm not disappointed. I absolutely love it. I feel like I feel just way too adorable, honestly. I feel like it's a very girly outfit. Just, I love it. I love everything, the way everything looks together. I've been styling this cardigan, the sweater, in different ways. I haven't styled this cardigan with this skirt that I've had for years. It served me well and it's serving still well. I decided to add polka dot Hosiery, it looks wonderful in my opinion with this whole shake vibe that that's going on here and the shoes and the bag. I love every single little thing. Of course, you can throw in a few accessories and you're good to go. I feel like this is a perfect outfit for someone who works in fashion, especially for right now for this weather. It's just great. Put a coat on and you're good to go. Next!
Okay, so how do you like this outfit? I absolutely love it. I love this jumpsuit. It served me well as well as the previous curl for years. It looks amazing and I want to say it's pretty comfortable, but honestly, it's not the comfiest thing out there, but it just looks great and, and it's very stylish. So yay, this is a good point. <laughs> anyway, I got some silver accessories here. I'm gonna come closer and I'm gonna show it to you. You see, we got some silver buttons here, silver zippers, silver kind of belt, zippers here. So I decided to go for silver here as well. I feel like it's a match. Matchy matchy. Okay, so how do we love this outfit? I think we love it, absolutely, because it's way too pretty and at the same time it's quite conservative, but then... Oopsie! <laughs> I really love these slits and I really love Lauren's skirts because you feel comfortable, but at the same time you can put something under and you're gonna be like, hey, and you are gonna be the only one who's gonna know that you're wearing something, yay! So yeah, I really love this outfit, love this skirt. If you've been following me for a while, you would probably know that I really love long pleated skirts. They're very comfy, they're very stylish. Sometimes might be a little bit problematic, maybe challenging even, I would say, to style them. But once you get the right outfit, it's just wonderful. It's very elegant, refined, and sophisticated. Like this one, for example. I also in my gilet, gilet, gilet. <laughs> I need to check the vocabulary. I know gilet um, era, and I normally just button them up, but I decided to keep them open so you can actually see my shirt a little bit better because. It's a cool shirt, I guess. There are no buttons here, no zips beside the zips that you saw on the sides. And it's a cool shirt, I guess. And this is the outfit. How do you like it? Like, this is what I'm talking about. It's so cute. It's just like, yay. It's a cool outfit. It's like lady boss. Definitely a lady boss. Anyway, time to change the outfit. Well, what you just saw was actually a trick recommended by some of you. Let me know who was it, because I don't really remember because it was some time ago. 
some time ago I complained that I don't really like, not, really, not that I don't really like, but it takes so much time to unbutton uh, and button up the shirt. So some of you actually suggested to leave a few buttons open and just uh, do what I did to pull it over you. Another trick, if you don't want your shirt or your sweater or anything, your top basically to move, just tuck it inside your hoser and you're gonna be all right. I don't really like putting the, my collar this way, but I just did and sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. And right now I look like a Russian oligarch. Yeah, yeah baby. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna change it and I'm gonna um, choose the shoes. I have to say this is a very work work outfit but I'm pretty sure there is gonna be someone who's gonna say something about this skirt length so if you got some regulations follow the regulations pick along the skirt this is only an inspiration and it kind of looks cute I got this oversized blazer over the shirt let me know in the comment section whether you would have preferred a more rough fitted silhouette drop a comment and I'm gonna do something here so basically I'm gonna style this shirt in different ways I mean not really but kind of basically I'm gonna try and style it with two different pairs of pants and let's see whether they work or whether they don't I'm gonna leave the shoes I'm gonna leave the bag I'm just gonna we're gonna say goodbye to this girl number two with the same shirt um let me know in the comment section whether you like it i have to say i love it it looks very professional and it looks cute these pants uh, were going viral some time ago uh, and they're from zara and they're really nice i have to say and they look great yeah they look great just find the right fit and you're gonna be in love with them well this is have it number two with the with the same blazer shirt shoes and bag uh let's change the pants and see what worked better with the rest And outfit number three and we got a totally different pair of pants so these are kind of palazzo pants but not really uh, 
I kind of forgot the worry, so. <laughs> anyway, this is outfit number three. Let me know in the comment section which outfit you prefer the most. This is just to show you that you don't need to go and buy every single time you see something you like. I mean, you can, you could, but there is no need to go and buy something new every single time. Like, you got the basics, we got the shirt, we got the blazer, just maybe get, get more shirts so you could change them. And we change the outfit simply by by changing the bottom, changing the pants, the skirt, and a couple of different outfits. Honestly, I really love this one. I think this one is my favorite. But you let me know in the comment section which was yours and let's change and try something else. Here is another outfit that I absolutely adore and I absolutely love. And what's not to love about this outfit? It's absolutely perfect. I mean, I love this skirt. Check it out. It's so cute. It's a checkered skirt. The fit is amazing. It's a wool skirt. It's super comfy and warm. And paired with the sweater, with a turtleneck sweater, it's just it just match made in heaven plus we got the boots we got the bag i almost fell but no i'm here i love this outfit let me know in the comment section how you feel about it i don't really feel like we need to add any accessories there is no need to add the belt it would make this outfit a little bit too heavy i mean we got the boots just a coat maybe a little hat it's up to you maybe a scarf something easy you know just accessorize a little bit but nothing too crazy okay keep it simple <laughs> let's move on and try something else shall we I'm not really sure how I feel about this outfit. I love it and at the same time, I'm not really sure. I really want to make these boots work with this outfit because I really love the top. 
and the skirt paired together. The back looks amazing with the skirt, matchy matchy. And I really wanted to wear the boots. Why you'd ask me? I don't know, I just wanted to wear the boots. I wanted to see whether it's gonna work. I tried the brown ones, it was a flop. These ones, oh, I'm not really sure. I mean, it kind of matches the top, but it's not the right model, I guess, for this outfit. I would have needed a different pair of shoes, probably something a slimmer with a zipper maybe, because these ones are a little bit too chunky and too wide, because when you look at them at this on the side, it just, no, they don't really work with this outfit in my opinion, but let me know how you feel about it, but I really wanted to, to make it work. And so I decided to leave it this way because I really want to see what you got to say. Well, I really hope you enjoyed today's try and haul. I really hope you enjoyed the outfits. Let me know in the comment section which outfit was your favorite and why. And of course, if you'd like to see more of my content or you just want to say hi to me, feel free to reach out. I'll drop links as usually in the description box below. Also, check out my website, tatianapolava.com basically and my vlog where you will be able to discover even more updates even more outfit ideas so check it out let me know in the comment section what you'd like to see next feel free to give this video a big thumbs up thank you and i will see you soon have an awesome day bye